for this project you're going to need scissors, a length of string or yarn, about two feet works, and a button. Now if you can find a big old coat button like this, that's great. If not, you can make your own button out of two or three layers of heavy cardboard glued together and uh, with a couple holes stuck right in there. And you can use that as a button from here on out. Now, once you have your button and your yarn cut to size, then you're gonna thread that yarn through the holes in the button. Pull that through and then just tie a quick knot on both of the cut ends of the yarn. And then you have something that looks like this. Now to use your buzz button, you're going to loop it and get it all wound up until you start to see coils forming on the yarn on each side. And then at that point, you can start pulling the yarn, the two ends away from each other. But when you do that, it's important to let your hands come back closer to get to each other again so it can recoil. And you can hear that noise it's making, hence the phrase buzz button. So this is a simple toy that you can make at home and enjoy.